Hi guys, I'm Action Jacqueline and welcome to my YouTube channel where I help you feel fit, flexible, and confident every single day. So today we are doing the top best seven stretches you should be doing every single day. They could be all together or they could be throughout your day, but these stretches are going to give you the longevity in your muscles and joints that you need. And also it's going to help prevent injuries and reduce any pain that you're feeling in your body. Before we get started, I do want to let you know about my amazing outfit from Fabletics. I absolutely love the print and the fabric. And remember, when you become a Fabletics VIP member, you get your first two leggings for only $24. It is a pretty insane deal. It's super fun, right? Makes your workouts just that much better. Okay, let's get into the stretches. Let's begin here. Down on our mats, you're going to extend your right leg forward, take your leg over, and we're gonna go into a spinal twist. So elbow comes on top of knee. You're gonna sink the hip bones down into the floor. Use this elbow to take the stretch deeper. So I'm really twisting from the navel up here. So lift up tall, breathe. And the best thing you could do for your stretches is to breathe. The breath is a signal to the body that it's okay to relax and release tension. And this is of course going to help reduce the amount of stress that you feel. It's going to balance your hormones. Your mind is gonna feel clear and calm. All those important things that you need when you are um, you know, stretching and working into your body. So let's go ahead and if you want to um, take it deeper, you can just tuck that foot underneath. You can even grab the knee like this. You could even add a little bind here and just squeeze that hand through. All right, so we're gonna go to the other side. So place the foot over, one minute for each pose. If you'd like to take it deeper, remember you can just tuck that foot underneath yourself, add a bind if you would like. So the bind would just be kind of threading that hand through, wrapping around and grabbing for your hands. All right, and release. So the next stretch that we're gonna do is going to be a chest opener. So you're gonna clasp the hands behind you, grab your hands and lift on up. So here, you could do it on your knees or you could be standing up. You could really do this anywhere. You could do it at your desk. You could do it at the kitchen sink, <laughs> anywhere, okay? Remember, you can do these stretches throughout your day. They don't have to be in order. They don't even have to be next to each other, you know? in a sequence, you can just use this video as a resource to create your stretching routine throughout the day. Good, you can even add a little bit of a neck stretch here. Release that tension here. So we spend so much time in a forward flexion, lots of times on our desk, or even just, you know, a lot of push-ups and things like that could create a rounded spine. So this is going to help create a nice open chest. And let's go ahead and stand on up. So we're gonna do a standing back bend. So we're going to reach the arms up and you're gonna extend the arms long, as long as you can. So this might be too much with the hands. If it is, then just go ahead and take the hands behind you and use it as like a little shelf on your hips. Lift the chest up. Maybe release the head back. Really make this for you. It doesn't have to be a static hold. You can really make it dynamic for yourself. And then even experiment with going kind of around the side. So going over here to the side and back and over to the side. Stretching and lifting and opening your whole body. You can even take the hands behind the head, lift the chest up, really release the thoracic spine. Good, and release there. All right, we're gonna come in now to our fourth pose, which is a forward fold. So you can either do this standing or seated. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take my feet about hip distance apart. 
And when you come into the forward fold, flex at the hips here, keep the spine long, release all the way down. There's so many variations here that you can try. You can grab onto opposite elbows here like this. You can even combine our second pose, which was the shoulder stretch. You can get two done in one pose, which I always love doing. You can take your shoulders and stretch them here like this. You can even take your hands underneath your feet to help deepen the stretch further and deepen the stretch in the feet and calves. So pick something you like, hold the stretch and breathe. So for your next move, it's going to be a low squat. So your legs are going to be a little bit outside of shoulders, toes are facing out, and you're gonna get into a nice deep low squat. So you gotta kind of find what works for you with your legs, all right? And if this is too much for you, I would put something underneath your heels here like this, like a little towel or something, and then you're gonna work your way down into this position. But what this does is it completely opens up your uh, hips, your inner thighs, your low back, it also strengthens your posture. It forces you to sit upright and it actually feels really, really good. If you're ever standing for a long time, you know, you've been like working around the house a lot or you've just been standing all day, this feels really good on the low back, helps with your posture. So let's hold here for a few more seconds. Just make sure that you're breathing into these stretches. That's the most important thing. So nice big deep breaths in and out to the nose and just feel the body begin to relax. Many times we hold on to tension without even realizing it. So this is your time to just sink into yourself and see, okay, where am I holding on to stress and why? Why can't I just let go? Let's just surrender, let go and release. Take one more big deep breath in. All right, now we're gonna go into our sixth stretch here. So we are going to come into pigeon pose. So. Uh, I'll show you one variation so you can do it here. This is definitely going to be the deepest variation or you could do it here if it's too much for you, right? So you just cross the foot over the knee and you can stretch right here or you can lean back on your back, pull the knees in towards your chest as well. So I'm gonna do it here on the floor like this but you can choose your variation. So go ahead and come on down and we're gonna hold for a minute on each side. Now this is going to create a really deep external rotation in the hips. It's really good for opening the hips. Um, our hips really get stuck in, you know, forward and back all the time. So this is allowing the joint to open and breathe into that joint. So with every time, every time you breathe into it, you feel, you feel breath flow, you feel the blood flow. And that blood flow is going to release tension because what pain is oftentimes is a reduction of blood flow and oxygen flow. So right now we are creating that flow again so that you can actually stretch and release all of that pain and tension that you might be feeling. Okay, switch sides. And focus on your breath. Continue to focus on your breath. Nice deep breath in and out through your nose. And come on out of that. For your last and final pose, it is going to be hanging. So I highly, highly, highly recommend hanging your hands on a bar every single day. What this is going to do, it's going to strengthen your grip. Most of us do not have grip strength and that's probably why you're feeling any sort of wrist pain, forearm pain. You know, we're on our computers a lot, so it's going to help strengthen your wrist. Plus when you're holding on to this, I want you to just completely let everything go. You might even feel the vertebrae begin to separate a little bit and I think it feels absolutely amazing. It's like a massage and chiropractic 
uh, session all in one and you just hang there. So just get one of these bars for your house, hold on to it. You can hang, you can start with 30 seconds and work your way up, you know, all the way to a minute and you're gonna release tension throughout your entire body. All right, those are all of the stretches that I really recommend that you do every single day for less injuries, less pain, better performance, and stronger joint stability. And remember, my outfit is from Fabletic, and you can get your first two leggings for only $24 when you become a VIP member. You can't beat this deal. It is so amazing, and I love all the different outfits. I've left the link for you down below in the description box. I'm Action Jacqueline. Make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I I will see you in the next video.